Yo, 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 what is going on YouTube? It's your boy Mo Spawn. I really needed to get this video out, man. Like, I'm really, really sorry. I really just can't do so much. Like, this video was one of the hardest videos I've ever created in my life just because, like, I can't do it the way I'm supposed to do it. Like, I'm using a flash drive. I'm using a voice thing. Like, I'm doing so much. I'm trying my hardest. I had to update you guys on the Kobe grind, everything we're up to. Uh, the plan is to get it. So this is basically everything that's happened in the past two weeks or so that, like, you guys didn't see. Like, polls-wise. I only showed the good polls. I didn't show anything else. And I'm trying I'm trying my best to get everything fixed in the next two, three days so you guys can see everything live and action and all that. And see my beautiful face, obviously, obviously. With all that said, thank you guys so much. Bro, my stash needs to get I don't even know what's going on with my mustache, bro. It looks like somebody, like, lives in here or something. <laughs> bro, don't look at me, bro. And with all that said, though, enjoy the video, and we'll talk soon. So, no face cam box. Is this the meta? Did we find it? Are we real? Are we him? Is it? Can I finally get a shaker? Is it possible? Probably not. I'll be content with another ruby for the exchange, I guess. That's all I could be content with at this point in life. I know they're going to make up for it right here somewhere. Somewhere. Well, one day, we're going to get an amethyst hollow. And that's how I'm going to know my life is... Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. This is the metal. This is the metal. Our first shaker. <laughs> Let's go. Oh, yeah. Big center. Oh, that's Bill Russell. Y'all are trolls. What? Tis the season, Bill? Does he even sell for anything? That's a good question, man. Y'all y'all trolls with that. There is no way y'all thought that was cool and not give me a card in the set. I got finessed, hard body. Do I gotta stop talking or we got, oh my gosh, another one. Bro, two shakers, same box. This is not real. I found the metal. I, oh, bro, no, not another bill. Not another, bro, two bills? Bro, what? Yo, he's really, tis the season in the past, man. This is really some past work. This is demonic. I really could have pulled two Amis in the set. Y'all not trying to give me kid? Y'all not trying to do that to me? Now, I obviously... It depends how much they quick sell for. That's so tough. I'm sure his price is really, really low. Like, extremely low. What is it? 33k each? Ah, sheesh, bro. They... What a box, though. Like, theoretically? What a box, man. Why in the world? No more face cam boxes. Like, it's not happening. Y'all not seeing my face for anything. Maybe I win more unlimited games without the face cam. Time out, time out. We might be onto something. No way. Oh, I was, thought it was a ruby. I thought. All right, we still got one more. This was an old gold box, I'm pretty sure. Straight up, because I wasn't talking. I'll blame it on that. We'll blame it on that, and we'll see how it goes when I do one more. Let's try this one again, and we talking it all the way through, bro. We're not shushing. There's no such thing. You can't make me be quiet. It's not a thing. It's not possible. We're pulling the heat. You can see it on my face, right? You can see the 2K. Can y'all see it? I, I know y'all all see it right here. Oh, 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 Tama, Tama. Oh, two bobs. Okay, okay. So one for the future exchange and one for now. I'll be back in a little bit. I'm not wasting that. I'm not wasting that at all. But yeah, basically after like if I post something like that, I wait an hour so I can be able to exchange it so I could trade it in as we finally pull another Abby, baby. Don't be. Don't be the guy. Yes, it's a small forward. I was going to say, don't be Billy. I don't want no more Billies as we get James Worthy. I'm worthy of a new player. A Laker. That's a sign. That's a sign. Kobe coming soon. Someday. Someday. Somewhere. And literally, I'm just going to be doing a voiceover the rest of the way. So you guys can see basically what I do. But what I really, really do is I exchange for deluxes, especially the rubies that quick sell for 4K. Why else? Why wouldn't you? So I have a lot, a lot of packs and I wish I was able to show them all to you guys. But unfortunately, I'm not. I'm just going to make this kind of quick, kind of just get through the motion through it. And this was literally the deluxe pack that I just got from that same box. So I pulled James Worthy and then I get a deluxe pack from it and I get another Worthy. And I'm like, bruh. Bro, there's a good thing about it, right? It's not bad. It's I do have an unauctionable one, so I could sell the other one. So I was like, all right, at least I get some MT back. And then 2K does this weird, weird thing where they already exchange it for you. But that's cool. I like it. I respect it. I appreciate it. Thank you for making my job easier. We do have a season two super pack. 
super pack. I was going to say, where's my super suits? And I get absolutely nothing from these, man. I never get anything good from these boys. Why would anyone want Sergio? We got like 10 free little ones like in our lives. Trust me when I say this video is going to heat up. It's going to heat up. It will. It will. It will. But for right now, let's go ahead and just take a look at some of these good pulls. We definitely pulled some good stuff in the free packs. We had too many. I, like this was the most packs i've ever had and i wish you guys were able to see it the whole way through because some of them were surprisingly good some of them not so good but i had a lot of shakers without a doubt as i pulled back-to-back -back rubies from those deluxes i did not see that coming never did i like to show you guys where these packs are coming from more or less like so you guys have an idea like this one was a deluxe poo and i get another amethyst i'm hot man i was feeling good i was feeling good as i get another worthy and now i'm just like bro is there anybody else in here? Like, what's up with all these worthies? It's worthy here, worthy there. I'm I'm not feeling worthy right now. I'm not. Like, there's so many other guys that I could be pulling. There's another Laker in Elgin. There's literally, like, Jason Kidd, one of my favorite player all the time. And instead, I have to go out here and throw this into a deluxe. Like, that's so, uh, that's so, uh. We got a swagger. Swagger like mine. And if I'm showing it to you, you know I'm pulling the heat, baby. I'm pulling the heat. This was pretty much from like five triple throw online wins or whatever. So that's a really cool pull. Especially that these are sellable now, man. Big shout out to 2K for making them sellable. The fact that they weren't in the past and now they are is huge. I know we, they should have always been. But hey, hey, progress is progress. That's all I got to say. Shout out to Hito. Probably end up selling that someday and i think this is gonna be the last deluxe type vibes like that are not from the real packs because i pulled three rubies from these and i thought that was cool i did not expect that because usually cards like that give you emeralds i have a level up equal chance pack and i end up pulling up oh my gosh a ruby dale ellis who is sellable like i said give me my twenty one thousand mt and now let's heat up with these beautiful, beautiful, man. I love these deluxes, man. These deluxes are fire. Even if they're unsellable, they be fire for real. Because the odds are higher and the odds are higher for worthy. Literally, bro. I'm so mad. I'm so mad. So I put back-to-back -back bills and now I'm like, oh, but like where are these just popping up left and right? I think this might be our fourth one at this point, bro. It really just, I don't know. I don't know. I have no comment no no nothing please don't talk to me don't don't i'm so <laughs> i was really crying in my head i wish y'all were able to see my face my reactions but obviously that's not a thing right now hopefully we have that moving forward very very soon that's all that matters so once we get back to where we were man those were good times as we pull another evidence you already know who it is i'm positive like i'm at this point I already know it's worthy 100% bro like there was no doubt in my mind it was gonna be James worthy but then a part of me is like bro I pulled so many they've been ammy 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 it's always worthy 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 like it's eventually gonna be Jason Kidd it's eventually gonna be Elgin Baylor and that was not the case I had to log out for that one because I just had to so I get off for an hour I go play something else I go do something with my wife I go do anything else and then I come back an hour later and I get a free deluxe. And look at this deluxe right after. It was worth it. Because now I get a ruby, right? And I'm going to show you guys what happens. So you take the ruby, you go ahead, and you exchange it. If I pull another ruby, it depends on how life is moving, right? So obviously, I'm not streaming. I'm not doing anything like that at the moment. So it's easy for me to get off or go do something else, right? I can hop on Call of Duty. I can hop on Fortnite. I could literally go do something with my wife. I could go chill, watch something, blah, blah, blah. And that's what I've been doing. But I take that ruby that I got from the Emmy and I pull another shaker. Let's go. Your boy is on fuego. But guess what? Please guess what, bro? Did I have to say it? You kind of knew, right? It's so bad, bro. I was tweeting about this because literally every single pack was worthy. I can't make this up. Like, I don't understand. And now I have to wait another hour. But I was able to, like whatever bro i just got through it we had these equal chances so we got an emerald and no one cares about that no one cares about the sapphire we only care about the rubies and up so one thing i will note right now i'm actually not completed with these yet there's still a lot i have to do so there's the rubies i have to do for triple threat online my favorite mode you feel me triple threat online where my demon slay easy peasy we take care of business in that mode like legit 
take care of business. We get that free Ruby. Now we got to take a look at the Ami. So I actually still have not yet to do that. And there's another Ami thing. So we'll work on that for the next video. We won't be doing that now. All right. That's the game plan. Look at these boxes, though, because I trust me, I stay opening packs like all day. All I do is open packs out here, bro. Y'all don't understand. Like, I just go through the motions. I'm hoping for a pull, and I'm not showing you any of that stuff. You guys are just watching me pull random stuff, losing my MT, my MT count going down. I'm not even pulling anything. Like, we started at, like, 2 mil probably when this all started, and now we're at 1.7. I'm buying a ruby just for the exchange. This is the most clutch thing ever. Buying a ruby for 10K to throw it in for 21k deluxe i think it's so beautiful as the past meets present packs are out and we pull a pj tucker our first time pulling that ruby the boxes are still just as bad as they were still giving us sapphire still no hope in the out here in the world like i don't understand why my luck has been so bad like extremely extremely bad in every way shape or form like the only thing that's been good is like whenever I pull a ruby because then I feel like I did something. But 2K has been keeping up with these locker codes sort of like I've been liking them like this Jaron Jackson code slash Marcus Saul. I love the Ascension one. If you guys didn't see what I got from that, I uploaded it yesterday. I got three Amethyst players from that. That was so fire. I was excited. I was happy. Made some MT as I do right here. I went for Jaron for a reason. He's my dog. He's my boy he always has they're unauctionable i knew i had both but i knew one of them was auctionable and it was jaron jackson jr so unfortunately he has shoes and badges but at the end of the day mt is mt right you want the mt the reason being is thirty thousand is so close to a box and it makes me able to open another one another one that's how i always see it that's how i always look at it and that's how i justify things bro unfortunately it just always has been that way and i will continue to be that and woo, it was worth it. And Amethyst, give me Elgin, give me Kid, give me some heat. And it's Bill Russell. My life in a nutshell. Straight up, bro. You can't make this up, bro. This is unbelievable. By all means, unbelievable. I've never seen anything like this where I pull the same dudes over and over again for not just one day, not just one set. This was going on for like a week, bro. This would not stop. I couldn't get away from both of these guys. They just would not go away. We're opening up base boxes still, still, still trying, just trying, hoping. My hopes were high. My hopes never go anywhere. And this Brandon Roy is going to give us some heat. I already feel it. I know it. I know it. Look at this. Look how many of these. This is how you know I open packs. This is how you know I have no life. You can see the MT going down. We literally lost so much so much people don't realize yes i'm a millionaire i always will be no i'm not always gonna be a millionaire by the end of this you will see that we're no longer millionaires because devin booker came out and i'm sitting here staring at him like bro we gotta buy him right we need him for kobe he's 183k right you can see i still haven't locked in collections i'll keep you updated at the end that's why we're doing this video so i could update you where we are what we doing all that good stuff sorry for the delay and I couldn't get myself to do it. I was like, we got to open boxes, man. <laughs> Maybe I could pull Devin Booker. Maybe he will be pulled. It's going to happen. And all I get is UD, man. UD. Base out her. And I get an Ami. Finally. Finally present Ami. Give me the... Actually, I realized later that there's very few things i want from here and it's definitely not chris middleton because these are for the Giannis lock-in and i still need the old guys man i still need them past boys i don't need these presents they are not necessary in our journey they're not necessary in anything and i'm like bro sometimes you gotta make that decision like i should go get a deluxe it's very rare that i ever quick sell but if i'm still on and i'm still feeling hot i stay on and here is our twenty-five thousand empty equal chance emmy yes twenty five thousand for a chris middleton bro i just had him i got him for deluxe non blocky block like why 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 imagine i pulled the diamond from any of these in my life imagine my luck was like that just kidding my luck is like that it's gonna happen we built different i hope you guys have been doing well 
at the end of the day, I do miss you guys so much. I hope you guys are enjoying this little this little montage of uh, me pulling Amy Shaker worthies. You feel me? Look at the Laker. Oh, different number 22, Elgin Baylor. I definitely thought that was worthy. You know I thought it was worthy, <laughs> but it was Elgin Baylor. So progress. Progress is being made. Okay, okay. You love to see it. Here's a base pack. Base shaker. Let's go back to back. That was literally the next pack. We went from Baylor to a small forward middle 10. We were hot. We were hot. Definitely feeling it, man. Definitely feeling it. Now, there's two different ways to go about pulling an Ami, right? You have the option to obviously throw in for deluxe or to sell. I think if they're sellable, you always sell. I think that's the right option, no matter what the options are. We have two deluxes this time, as you guys can see, because we got the Ruby Roy. Roy for a deluxe. We looking forward. And actually, that Ami is going to get swapped. But they already swap it for some reason. I really hate that they do this for you. Like, I don't understand it at all. Because I could have messed up and just quick sold there and not noticed. But I know better. I definitely know better. So let me swap so I can take my MT. I obviously want the MT. That's more important to me than anything else. Because it allows me to open more boxes. But I'm done. I'm done. We taking PG1 right now. Devin Booker, that guy, he, him. He been him. I'm going to badge him. I'm going to shoe him. I'm going to do all that good stuff. Definitely, I'm giving him Grinches. You already know he's going to be here. He's going to be here for a while. But that doesn't stop me from opening packs. It never will stop us. As we pull an Emmy. I'm waiting for that diamond, bro. Like, even these deluxes, I was expecting a diamond. But it's okay. Because we already know a Wemby set is coming. And we need that good luck when Wemby drops, man. I don't care about LaMarcus Aldridge. I don't care about this or that. I mean, I do because it helps us. But obviously, it's not like I'm doing this for free. Like, I'm obviously spending so much. Not real money, but in-game money, time, whatever you guys want to call it. And we just spent 15,000 VC on this equal chance pack. And I get a sapphire that hurts me so bad. Bro, prayers up to Kelly. I hope he comes back good, man. This guy was playing really, really well. And then just bad accident, bro. I hate I hate it, bro. I hate drunk drivers. I was just going to say that. But yeah, and I get another Ruby from the other man, bro. Like, why can't I get lucky on these? Like, that's so much to get absolutely nothing, bro. It makes me mad, upset, and it makes me open more packs. And that's like, that's where the cycle never ends. Just depression. As I put three Rubies in this, and then I messed up because I thought I can go ahead and exchange one, log off for an hour, come back, do it again. And I did it like three times. And then only to find out that it doesn't work like that. And basically, I have to back out. So I'm only allowed to do that like once, technically. So I was just wasting my own time. But at the end of the day, this is what we have left. This is our progress. We're missing the 84K for that man. We're missing three diamonds still for Penny Hardaway, man. Three diamonds plus an Ami, even though I pulled a billion Amis. Just so, so unlucky at the end of the day. We're missing one card for Iggy, which is Kemba Walker. If only I could have got lucky somewhere else. Thankfully, we don't need this set at all for Giannis, so we can skip and hover over that. We will make the MT. We will figure it out. Like Tyrese, this stuff isn't too expensive. We'll figure all that out. I'm not too, too stressed about him. Hopefully, hopefully, hopefully I can make it happen, especially with the Christmas events and all that. But this is the set that's going to break a lot, a lot of wallets, a lot of homes. Hopefully, we can make this one happen. Victor Wembanyama is going to be a must-have for sure. Bro, he's honestly the most pay to win so far. So at the end of the day, I'm very, very behind because of like a lot of challenges I didn't do yet. Hopefully I will get down with those challenges first before I buy anything. We will make our MT. I'll show you guys that whole process. I plan to. My plan is to have everything fixed in the next two days. That's what I've been telling you guys. And then hopefully from there, we'll go on that Kobe grind. It'll be a lot of fun, especially with everything we have moving forward. You guys see the MT is low right now. It's because I bought those Hall of Fame option packs. I didn't show it to you guys here. I'll show it to you guys in the next one. But I bought them. They were 200K each. I ended up buying both of them. And now we're broke, broke. With all that said, though, Kobe coming soon. I'll catch y'all later. It's been your boy Most and Ballin' out.